Why did Azula tell Ozai that Zuko killed the Avatar in Ba Sing Se? The simple explanation provided in the show is that Azula figured that Aang survived, and she wanted Zuko to take the blame for Aang surviving. So when it's discovered that Aang is alive, everyone's going to be angry at Zuko for not being able to actually kill the Avatar. And it's going to really hurt his reputation, and he's going to be in big trouble, whereas Azula will not get in any trouble at all. But this explanation is way too simple and also way too complicated. It's too complicated because it just assumes that Azula is super smart and a super genius, and she just somehow knew in the back of her head that Aang would have survived getting hit by her lightning. And it just makes no sense. Also... It's too simple because it's just like, oh, Azula knows things. Azula is overpowered. Azula uh, is just awesome at everything. And that's just too much of a simple explanation. And additionally, when Azula is talking to Zuko and um, they're talking about the Avatar and how he presumably fell in Bossing Se, Azula says... Um, well, Zuko, you have nothing to worry about unless the Avatar somehow survived. And Zuko suddenly has a flashback of uh, Katara showing him the spirit water from the Oasis. And Zuko thinks that Katara might have used the spirit water to uh, resurrect Aang. But there's no way Azula would be able to actually read minds. Reading minds is not a power in the Avatar universe. So how on earth would Azula know that Katara had spirit water. She has no idea about the spirit water. Azula doesn't know about the spirit water. And um, it just seems that she read Zuko's expression, and she thought that Zuko thought that Aang survived. But how would she even trust Zuko's instincts? Because for all she knows, Zuko might just totally be wrong with his instincts. So, I mean, would she just believe Zuko's instincts or Zuko's thoughts uh, at face value? There's no way she would do that. So um, it just doesn't make sense because there's no way she would have gotten all of that just by looking at Zuko's face. So I think the real reason that Azula told Ozai that Zuko killed the Avatar in Ba Sing Se is because Ozai was probably very angry with Azula because Azula essentially went behind Ozai's back. Azula recruited Zuko without Ozai's permission Ozai's original mission to Azula was for Azula to capture Iroh and Zuko. Now Azula captured Iroh, but she didn't capture Zuko. She brought him back and reinstated him as a crown prince. And Azula effectively ended Zuko's banishment. Azula had no right or authority to do that. And she's essentially defying the word of the Fire Lord. So obviously Ozai hates being disobeyed, and we saw uh, what he did to Zuko simply for speaking out of turn. So, yeah, Ozai hates being disobeyed, and Azula just disobeyed him. Azula went behind Ozai's back, and Azula essentially subverted Ozai's authority, and Azula undermined Ozai's authority as a Fire Lord. The Fire Lord, Ozai, banished Zuko, but Azula just unilaterally decided to bring him back. So Ozai was probably furious and so super angry. And even when um, Azula would have told Ozai that Zuko helped take over Ba Sing Se, I doubt that would have been enough to make Ozai less angry. So, most likely, Ozai was screaming and just fuming at Azula, and Azula got scared. And Azula, all of a sudden, on the spot, uh, made up the lie that Zuko was the one who killed the Avatar. And when Ozai hears that Zuko killed the Avatar in Ba Sing Se, all of a sudden, Ozai gets less angry because the Avatar was the Fire Nation's biggest threat and enemy. And the Avatar was killed, and Zuko's the one who killed him. So technically, that is worthy enough to end Zuko's banishment. And Ozai did say that Zuko had to bring back the Avatar if he wanted to end his banishment. So um, that really just fits Ozai's standards. And by killing the Avatar, the Fire Nation's worst enemy, Zuko has done the best thing he could possibly do for the Fire Nation. So Ozai probably felt a lot better. And he stopped being angry once Azula told him that lie. So, and Azula was probably relieved as well because that means that Ozai's not going to take his anger out on her. And 
Ozula clearly is scared of Ozai to an extent when we see their one scene together in uh, the final episodes of the show. So <clears throat> I think that Ozai was furious with Azula for bringing Zuko back without his permission. So Azula got scared and made up the lie that Zuko killed the Avatar simply because she was scared of Ozai. But it turned into a more convoluted lie because she eventually deduced that Aang survived and she figured that Aang was alive and that by telling Ozai that uh, Zuko had killed Aang, that would get Zuko into trouble and not her. And I do wonder how Ozai reacted uh, or how what Ozai did or said to Azula um, after he discovered that Aang was alive and that Azula had lied to him, but that's for probably another video. <laughs>